let's explore um, seawall from Cole Harbor up to downtown. As you can see, there are these um, condominium towers here, skyscrapers. Look at this nice big boats here. This interesting building here on some kind of stand There's, that might be a replica of some old building in Vancouver. Some log house. And that's the view of Cole Harbor Marina with the condominium buildings in the background. And on the other side of this, uh, of this uh, little bay, uh, there is a Stanley Park. And here we are on a cyclist route. The lights are still on for some reason. And on the right hand side, we can see tall high rises. Most of them condominiums where people live, like residential towers. It is early morning. Uh, there are not many people on uh, the seawall at this time of the day. Most people go to work. Fountain, which is which doesn't function in winter months. So let's watch. One of the seaplanes. No more talking about it. The way it is, the way it is. It's no mystery. There's no getting around it. When you're here, when you're here, we got chemistry. When and this is a floating platform with an engine. And the seaplane from the short distance. You see these orange structures in the distance, that's a port of Vancouver. So let's use the elevator. Seaplane terminal, Burrard Street, Sea Bus, Canada Line. So, yeah, level two. And uh, in the uh, distance you can see Canada Place. Here is a nice view of the mountains again. Stanley Park. This big complex with the lights inside. That's a convention center. I believe it's a Christmas market. That's interesting. That's the famous Orca which is a little bit blurry. When we ignite, we are stars in a darkened sky. When you leave, don't forget to remember, don't forget to remember me. And this is the structure for the Olympic Flames with a Cactus Club restaurant in the back. Vancouver Christmas Market. Okay, and we are getting closer to Gastown, which is an old town old part of Vancouver and a waterfront station a coffee place blends coffee there's the waterfront station
one of the streets. It's like a restaurant here. Souvenir shop. Historic steam clock. Steam clock is not that old, even though it seems like from the Victorian era. And it's not really a steam powered clock. So it's a mechanical clock, I believe, uh, combined with the electricity. 